This is Mexico City, once called Tenochtitlan, the mighty capital of the Aztec Empire. And hidden behind this nondescript facade is a structure as historic as it is gruesome. Buried under layers of rubble and dust is a tower of human skulls. It was first discovered in 2015 during restoration to the building that now covers the site. Archaeologists have so far uncovered well over 600 skulls and have been working for the past six years to uncover the whole structure and to learn more about its construction. This is the external facade of the skull tower on the east side. The skulls were mounted on a fence-like structure and set in place with mortar. The tower, 16 foot in diameter, is believed to be part of a skull rack from a major temple, now buried beneath the centre of the modern-day city. Known as the Hue Zonpantli, the skull rack stood on the corner of a chapel to the patron of the Aztec capital. The Aztecs were a group of Nahuatl-speaking peoples that dominated large parts of central Mexico from the 14th to the 16th centuries. Their empire was overthrown by the Spanish conquistadors who captured Tenochtitlan in 1521. Historians say many of the severed heads could be of captured warriors, a public display that would have struck fear into the hearts of the invaders. Certainly this context where there are many semi-detached skulls and where you are also seeing a tower on each side made up of skulls, it must have been shocking for the people who saw it. Then without a doubt it's a way to show off or demonstrate power or capability of the Mexican people. While the majority of the skulls are young men, the archaeologists also made a surprising discovery. They had thought that they were only going to find men, warriors, prisoners of war, but no. What we are seeing is there is also an important representation of women and children too, that we hadn't expected. It was not expected we'd find them here. It suggests women and children may have had a more important role in Aztec culture than previously thought and could be evidence that some of the remains are of people who were killed in ritual sacrifices, aimed at appeasing Aztec gods. Archaeologists believe the tower dates back to between 1486 and 1502. The secrets that the skulls have been guarding for more than 500 years have provided new and important insights into Aztec culture. <laughs>